Hello everyone and welcome back to our blind let's play 13 Sentinels Aegis Rim. My name is Flatless Bird. This is your story based gaming channel and today we're going to start with the lowest percentage character that we can play, which is Megumi. Uh, yeah, this, this is interesting because uh, she has 25, but we can't do hers. He's got 14, can't do his. Uh, a can do his, uh, not Sean can do hers. So yeah, uh, basically she's really the only one we can do at the moment. Might as well continue the storyline. Uh, Megumi Yakushichi is assigned a task to shoot witches with a magical gun. One of the targets, A Sekigara, used to be Jiro's comrade. Yes. Hope you all having a wonderful, fantastic day today. Dinner time at the Karabe house. I'm back. I guess Juro hasn't come home yet. Fluffy isn't here either. I should get dinner ready. I mean, there's 13 Sentinels, right? And there's only, what, like seven of us at this moment? So that means there's still probably, what, like six or seven characters that we haven't unlocked yet? That's probably why the percentages seem so high on a lot of these characters at like 42% or so. But we're still only about 28% through with all the stories because there's a lot of other stories we haven't even unlocked yet. Stop out of the third. Shimada coming in to pinch hit. He's closing in on a thousand hits. This could be it. Come on, Shinada. You can do it, buddy. Come on. Come on. Aw, oh, they're not going to tell me what happened. Aw. An up and coming star to keep an eye on. Miyuki Inaba-chan. Here's Miyuki. She's really taken Japan by storm. So it should come as no surprise that she's in this week's top 10 rankings. Don't know much about her yet. Now, on to an update of the ongoing Tsukuba Expo. The event has seen a record number of visitors this year, leaving the site heavily crowded even during the holidays. Stop out of the third. Shimada coming into Benjamin. Oh, that's the same. He's close again on a thousand hits. Alright, put on apron. And then why I guess cook dinner? What should I make for dinner? What should we make? Uh, last time we had grilled mackerel, didn't we? Let's go with Hamburg steak this time. I think we have some ground beef. I'll make Juro's favorite meal. Time to cook some Hamburg steak. Really? Hamburg steak's his favorite? I wonder what that is, Hamburg and steak. Done. I have to look that up later. I'm home. Oh, oh, hey. What a feast. Yeah, she loves to cook, Miracle. doesn't she? Did you make all of this? Amazing. Segoy. We'll eat once Juro gets back. That, that is the word. Why don't you go wash up while we wait? Right, Segoy? Right. Means like awesome or amazing or something. Oh wow, you came back. I mean, of course you can come back. It's just, I know Sounds you come back like that quick. Hungry. It's okay. I will wait. Well, it seems like Juro is going to be late. Go ahead and eat before it gets cold. No, I could never. Please, I insist. Go ahead. Eat up, buddy. Uh, uh, are you sure? But what about you, Megumi-san? Don't worry. I'll eat with Juro. I see. In that case, I'll do as you suggest. Thank you for always preparing our meals. 
Yeah, that's it was amazing. As delicious as ever. Oh, thank you. Can I help you with anything? That's okay. I've already put away the cutting board and everything. Why don't you go watch some TV and relax? TV? That's better. Stick around. Bring up our uh, flowchart as well. So, probably house dinner prep number two. So, last time we went through prep number one and there was no um, alternating paths. So far, it doesn't look like there's any alternate paths here as well. You know, Miura kun. You don't have to wear your hat in the house. The surgical scar on your forehead doesn't bother me. Aww. How did you know this scar was from surgery? How did you know that? Did I tell you? Uh, well. Well. It, um. Just a lucky guess. Oh come on! You're the worst I liar. See. I swear. Remember. Oh. It all how? happened right here. How do you know about the scar? Looks like we're not gonna have to wait long for the answer, at least. Last week at Krabi House. Hi, Fluffy. Miura is a witch. You can't overlook him just because he lives here. But Juro could be home any minute. Does it have to be now? Yes, right now. Hmm. What is up with this cat? Like seriously, is this an evil cat or is this a good cat? I, I'm 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 leaning towards he's an evil cat. But. Now on to the next headline: the video store explosion that occurred today in Kiyakicho. An investigation found that the accident was the result of a gas leak. This is what happened before. Really? What happened? Gas leak? I can't seem to shoot him or anything. Sure, I need to do this, Fluffy. I don't want to shoot him. Hurry up and shoot him right in the forehead. Oh. Is that how he got the scar? Cause he got shot. Miracle. You always wear your hat, even when you eat. Megumi-san. Why is that? It's because I have a scar on my forehead. I thought it might be unpleasant. Oh, you don't have to worry about that. So he forgot about all this because she shot him. Hmm. That shoot the cat. No. That scar. It allows you to pilot a sentinel. Isn't that right? How do you know about that? You want to know how? I'll tell you. But can you show me your forehead first? <sighs> I'm sorry, but I have no choice. Dang! Hurt, but you'll soon forget. It's just brutal! I'm sorry, Miyurakun. Don't touch him, he's dangerous. Just as I thought. He's had surgery. There's a component embedded in his forehead. It forces them to use their magic. Who would do such a thing? Humans, obviously. There's many that greatly covet this power. But it's not entirely bad. That component gave him immunity to the curse. What curse? This is a good catch. The curse? What curse? Yes, he is able to use magic and not suffer the same fate as Juro. Huh? All right, he's sealed. It won't be long before he wakes. I'd get out of here if I were you. Get out? A curse, huh? A curse? A 
Curse of the Sentinels? Next, we bring you a follow-up report on the gas explosion in Kayakicho. The administration claims these explosions are being taken seriously. Gas companies have been put on immediate notice and instructed to be vigilant in their inspections. Gas explosions? Something doesn't feel right. I'm home. Huh? Hey, Jiro. Kun, have you been at home the entire day? Jiro. Can we talk to Amira? No. Okay, let's talk to Jiro. Welcome back. Dinner's on the table for you. It's fine. I'm not hungry, actually. Well, I'm hungry. I would eat all Come that. On. I'm sure you'll change your mind once you start. Why do you care about me so much anyways? Oh, is that bad? <sighs> Just quit treating me like a child. Come on, she cares. Miyurakun? What's wrong? I'm sorry. But there's somewhere I need to go. I won't be long. A gas explosion? I need to see for myself. Hmm. Something else is going on there. Oh, hey, what's up, cat? You failed to shoot a Sekigahara. You're going too damn slow. All right, sorry. Why am I listening to you again? Oh, that's right. He promised a, uh, he would return a juror to us, right? Why were you taking so long in there anyways? Striking stupid poses with your gun doesn't accomplish anything. <laughs> when it comes to things like this, you need to do the deed quick. You gotta be cool when you do Quickly, it, though. Quickly, you got that? The style points. <sighs> That's what Paper Mario is teaching me. I'm gotta sorry, have style. Catch that. Got it. Well, that and Persona 5. Persona 5 did style like few games really do. Well, nothing that can be done about it now. But you'd better not screw up this time. This time? Shu Amiguchi, the floppy haired dunce that hangs around Juro. He is also a witch. <gasps> you should still have some bullets left. Seal his powers tomorrow. Think you can handle that? I'll get it done. A fifteen AM Sakura High School Front Gate. I'm not talking to you if I don't have to. I don't trust this cat. I, I I really just don't trust this cat. I and I'll talk to the cat. Oh hello, Jiro. You were waiting for me on purpose, weren't you? Actually, I was going to talk to the cat, but yeah, yeah, I was waiting I keep for you. Telling you, if they find out, we'll, we'll get expelled. expelled. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. Finishing each other's sandwiches. Oh. Are you watching me? Good morning, Amiguchi Kun. Oh, this is Amiguchi Kun. Fine. Did you leave your motorcycle nearby again? Sure did. But won't it be bad if the school finds out? Nah, it just looks like a motorcycle. <laughs> it's a regular bike. That's pretty what? cool. It's obviously a joke. Oh, <laughs> that would be cool though. Into school, so no big deal. You can still get in trouble. Whatever. Our school doesn't care. I was wondering, can I come over today? Sure, why not? Great. Oh right, gonna swing by the vending machines before class starts. Okay, I'll see you after school. Yeah, let's go follow him. I want to see the list of the rest of the conversation. After school, Sakura High School, third floor, hallway. So I heard about the delinquents at our school. Apparently, they used to be a lot worse. I heard that too. My senpai told me. Ogata-kun from 1D really reformed them. But isn't he a delinquent too? Yeah, but he's different from the others. No, I'm not used to rapping. Plus, not at all. Gucci-kun hangs out with him. Oh, he is so dreamy. Okay, we can go to Krabi's house. How oh, terrible. 
Why did you do that quiz? Man, pop quizzes just aren't fair. Hey, you know Amiguchi? He's a first year like us. The girls fawn over him. He's great at sports. And his grades are higher than those nerds that study all the time. Wow, he's really got it all. Totally unfair, man. Agree with you on that. Any other ears dropping? Don't think I can do really anything else except go to Carve's house. We can try to move time along. But I don't really see anything happening. Now if we check our flow chart, it looks like there's only thing, one thing we can do. New building rooftop. That's a red key. I don't have that thing yet. Hmm. So is this gonna loop me? Like, didn't this loop me last time? Let's go ahead and try it. Same time, Karabe House. I'm yeah, we got looped again. Back. I guess Juro hasn't come home yet. I wonder if he's mad at me. I should get dinner ready. Well, let's try to do the same thing again here and hopefully we'll get a different, uh... What, what is it we need? We need a, uh, the rooftop, right? New building rooftop. What? Ah, uh, let's make gold mackerel. I think Juro would like some fish. I'll grill some mackerel. Oh, and simmer some taro. You know me, I'm a penguin. I like fish. Juro. Welcome back. Juro. Okay, so we're back here. Are you watching me? Oh. Fine. Good morning, Amiguchi-kun. Maybe I had to overhear it from them. Did you? It's up. Uh, just talking about the bike. Oh, here we go. Fluffy. Um. Hey, Miwa-chan. What do you want now? Just hurry up and lure <laughs> the target already. She's like, I'm getting away from this crazy person to talk through a cat. Anything else? By the way, you stop fast forwarding when you move. So if you see me fast forwarding and then it stops, it's only stop because I'm moving. Okay, I need to overhear something about so I heard about the rooftop. Yeah, but he's I wanna go back to Robbie's house. Come on, what do I find this out? Man, hey, you know what? The girl's fun and his grades are high. Wow, he's totally unfair. Totally unfair. Hmm. It's gotta be someone that I can, like, eavesdrop on. But I don't see anything. What am I missing, guys? I can't go inside the uh, the buildings. Or the classrooms, I should say. People aren't talking. I had three items I can't use. Can jump back this checkpoint though. Maybe there's something I had to do outside. 
Like, what happens if I quickly go inside? How'd you do? Oh, man, hey, you know the girl's fun and his grades are high. Wow, he's really totally unf. Mm -hmm. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I'm missing something. I just don't know what it is. What am I missing? How do I know I'm even missing something? I had to like get Amaguchi before he uh talks to uh Juro. No. Uh -huh. What's up? There we go. What do you want? Uh, kind of just had to get in the middle of them, I guess. You, it's you I'd like to see, Amikuchi kun Me? You're from 1C, aren't you? I am. My name is Megumi Yakushiji. Cool. So what can I do for you? Well, I don't really want to talk about it here. Could we meet somewhere later? Just the two of us? Like on the rooftop? Uh, oh, <laughs> I see. How about after school? Let's say the roof of the new building? Excellent. The roof? Yep. I'll be waiting. It's hard being so popular. Ooh, finally. It looks Does mad. Bother you? No. Bye. Hmm. I see. Yeah, I definitely bothered him. Fluffy. I know what you're going to say. Do the deed quick, right? I won't fail this time. <laughs> <laughs> you better not. Just watching, she's like, girl's weird. Alright, now we should be able to go to the uh So I heard about the delinquents at our school. No. Apparently they used to be a lot worse. Um I heard that too. My son Ogata kun but is him. Why does it keep saying Krabby House? How did I... you do on that quiz? Ah, oh, there we go. I had to consider it. There we go. I wonder if hey, he's you know, already on the roof. He's a first year like us. The girl spawn over him. He's great at sports. All right, all right, all right, all right. Didn't get stuck on that one too long this time. There he is. All I have to do is shoot him. It'll only take a second. Okay. Here we go. Oh boy. Oh, someone else is here. Oh, I totally forgot. Hmm, you weren't supposed to come. What's happening? Oh, this is Yakushiji-san, from 1C. She stopped me this morning. Told me she had something to talk to me about. <sighs> this shit again? Sheesh. Sometimes you're real annoying to be friends with. I'll just get out of your way then. <sighs> Okay. Again? Oh, just stuff from middle school. Girls used to confess their love to me in front of them all the time. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. Is that what this is about? Oh, my God. I'm sorry. Really. But I've got feelings for someone else. <laughs> That's not what I came here to tell you. <laughs> oh, sorry. Awkward. So, what do you need? I need to shoot you. I guess I just assumed. Sorry about that. Well, what is it then? <sighs> uh, die witch die? I need to apologize. This might hurt a little anyway. I'm not killing. Oh my god. Right in the Mission face. 
Sentinel number 20. Transmitting. Oh, uh, what? Oh, what is going on? What's going on? Yeah, that's what I said. You just, you just got jacked into the Sentinel. Oh, is this supposed to happen, is it? Robot. No way. Juro. What did you, um... You... You shot Ami Kuchikun with a gun. I heard. And then a giant robot appeared. I didn't shoot him. You saw everything? But why did you... Where did it fly off to? I like how he's more concerned about where the robot fell off to, the fact that she shot someone with a gun. I'd be like, get away from me. What the hell did you do this time? I did exactly what you told me to do. Fluffy. He must have come into contact with Miura too. Damn it. How irritating. I'm not shooting Juro. Juro, he... He saw me do it. I'll take care of it. What are you still doing here? Don't hurt him. I need to manipulate his memories. C can we get rid of the cat? Make him forget everything he saw. You think I can do that with you hanging around? Take a hint and scram. Come on, chop kick the cat. <gasps> come on, come on. What if they're in? Aww. Now that I could no violence against cats, just this cat. This cat is making me mad. Interesting. I can still play as her, but there's hmm. The next fight was Joe Karabi's friend Shu Amaguchi. Although she succeeded in shooting him, it resulted in the sudden appearance of giant robot, all which was witnessed by Juro. By the way, let's look at number of characters. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight characters. So we're still missing five. <sighs> Dinner part three. Okay, so this is something new. I'm home. Oh. Shiro. Um. What is it? You're making a weird face. Huh? Um. Well, because of what happened on the roof today. He doesn't remember. The roof? What are you talking about? I am really worried about Fluffy here. Fluffy. He really did alter his memories. Joe's memory says my add block cloud. Can't hit triangle for some reason. It's nothing. I'll start making dinner. Oh, you don't have to. I'll just make instant noodles or something later. You can't eat that for dinner. It won't take long, so hang on just a bit. Why not? I'm basically eating just regular okay. spaghetti tonight. <sighs> if I eat anything at all. I really just wanted some ramen. What was that? During a routine flyby, a U.S. military helicopter. I went to Sakura High School at low altitude. I went to put on the apron and, and I missed something. To Ayame Park. That must be a the Sentinel. US military helicopter. That's a lie. That's not a helicopter. That was definitely a Sentinel. Exactly. Did Fluffy do this too? What alter oh. perception in reality? Is it possible to do that? Can we go? Check it out. Nice evening. Oh, there you are. Fortunately, there were no injuries reported in the aftermath of the U.S. military helicopter crash. First gas explosions, now helicopter crashes. Human cities really are the worst. Oh, shush, cat. We both know that's not it. Change the channel for me, will you? You change the channel yourself. For my cat it sounds like a you problem. I watched Fluffy be like the nicest cat in the world and I'm here just like doubting him and yet he's actually a hero in the game. 
<laughs> he definitely comes off as a villain, though. I mean, come on, give me a break. Juro's memories of what happened on the roof. You really did erase them. You gave me no choice. But if you can do it so easily... Can do it to me, too? It's to say you won't do the same to me. Ah! Well, nothing really. So it's possible that you won't restore his memories. And are just using me for your own personal gain. If I was a bad guy, sure. Maybe you are a bad guy, I'm just saying! Change the channel of the button. Oh. There was no US helicopter crash. It was different from the one Juro was piloting. But it was a sentinel. Altering the news is part of your powers, too? You think cats are some kind of little furry gods? You're no cat. You know, I definitely but, isn't. Uh, it'd be pretty crazy if there was a talking cat wandering around. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> what if you're the crazy one? You know, it's very possible. Just a figment of your imagination. I believe it. Maybe there's no such thing as magic. Stop treating me like I'm dumb. Change the buttons. Magic. Any sufficiently advanced technology would be magic to someone. From magic. Exactly. Clark's three laws, huh? Well, guess there's no point in hiding it anymore. I'm a cat-like robot from the future. Is he serious? I gave you a secret gadget. Like, I, it's hard to tell sometimes with this oh, thing. Oh yeah, the time machine's inside your desk drawer. Wanna check out my four-dimensional pocket? Quit messing with me. I don't think he's lying though. Like, I actually do believe him that he is a robot from the future. The Dimos code. By sealing those that hold power, we'll be able to defeat the kaiju. That's what you said, right? I said that you all wouldn't have to die. Tell me what you're really trying to do. Otherwise, I won't help you anymore. That's going against our contract. <sighs> Fine, I'll make an exception this time. Huzzah! Even if you seal the witches, the kaiju will still come. So, how do I stop? Then what are we sealing them for? Exactly. This is a game. A game of survival. So what, you're playing chess and we're all playing checkers? I've simply been readying the playing field. And now the witches will join in the fight. They'll have no choice but to take their sentinels into battle. Then, what I've been shooting them with is... A magic that forces them onto the battlefield. No. Anything can be resolved with a magical spell. A happy ending for everyone. Except all of us who you die. Know that's not the way it works. Your world's future is on the line. You need to fight to win it. I'm just here to watch it happen. You're talking to me way too much today. What does it matter to you who I am anyways? That's a lot. It's what humans Your do. Your concern is for Juro, right? I've been looking for memories in that busted brain of his. It's like trying to sift through mud. And it's all for you. But if you want to break our contract, then I'll stop right now. It won't be hard to find someone more capable than you. Ouch. An honest girl who actually wants her wish granted. <sighs> now, if you plan on upholding your end of the contract, then I need proof. I want you to shoot your friend. Tomi Kisaragi. She's a witch. Oh. I can't do that. Remember your contract. Remember it real good. Tommy. Really don't like you, cat. 
Think about the contract, then decide what you want to do. <laughs> I'm watching TV now. Quit bothering me. Yeah, well, how can you watch TV when they just stand in front of it, huh? Huh? Can you watch TV now? Can you watch TV now? Contract with Fluffy. The day Fluffy arrived at the Crabby house. Juro? Why are you sleeping out here? You're gonna catch a cold. Don't wake him up. Where did you come you from? Can. But how? You know what? No TV for you. I said, don't wake him up, idiot. We call an idiot. I'm fixing him. This prank is starting to get on my nerves. I don't want to be a part of it anymore. Is someone trying to test me? You really are a suspicious one, aren't you? Your cute girl charm is quickly wearing off. It's time to start accepting your reality. But talking cats don't exist. That's right. And yet here I am. Talking cat has been added to the clock cloud. Even better, I know your wish. Hasn't Juro said anything to you? Something about his dreams, perhaps? Now that you mention it, he did say he had a dream about getting in a robot. Yes, I've been digging through his memories. Will that make him remember everything? Maybe, if they're still in there. I can find memories and put them back into an empty head. Pretty amazing, I know. Well, that's the end of your trial period. I gave you a preview of the benefits you'll get from me. Trial period? Anything further requires a contract. <sighs> oh, fine, I'll answer any questions you have. And then you have to decide. After you agree, there'll be no more questions. I expect you to carry out your duties with no complaints. Don't be shy. Ask me something. Okay. If you're not going to ask anything, then make your choice. No, no, no. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, think some more. What exactly are you? A magic cat, obviously. Obviously, uh-huh. You said you came from a world that was destroyed? That's right. My world was destroyed by Daimos. Daimos? You mean the kaiju, right? You heard that from Juro Izumi, didn't you? The curse that summons them. That's the Daimos Code. And all the witches in this world are affected by it. Hmm. A lot of interesting things there. So Fluffy is some sort of extraterrestrial creature. And the Daimos destroyed his world. So he's coming to our Earth. Maybe not necessarily to defend our Earth, but maybe to pay back the Kaiju. So if that's true, uh, the cat couldn't ne doesn't necessarily have to be good, but not necessarily evil as well. Sort of has its own agenda? Or can we actually trust it? Let's say I do agree to this contract. How do I know you'll hold up your end of the deal? Well, aren't you rude? Cats are free spirits, but they are not con artists. A cat who betrays his word is nothing more than an animal. If you don't trust me, then say so. You're only wasting time. I don't trust you. <laughs> Can I just say that? I don't trust you. I, I don't. The Dimos Code. The Dimos code. You mentioned that before. 
You said it was a relic of an ancient civilization? A terribly old relic. From a magical civilization that existed millions of years ago. But if it's from that long ago, humans would have still been apes. It's pretty crazy, right? That's interesting. Diamond's code no longer has anything, but the contract is still here. Let me go to the witch and then we'll do the contract again. Can you tell me more about the witches? They are those born with the power of magic. Piloting sentinels, using gates. It's only a fraction of their power. And Juro is one of them? That's right. He's a witch too. What will I have to do to fulfill my end of the contract? At least a general idea. Your job isn't hard. First, I will give you one of my magical tools. You will use that to seal the witches. Seal them? What happens after that? The Daimos Code will call the Kaiju. If you seal the witches that have access to it, you will be able to live longer than you are fated. What? Oh, we only cared about um getting Drew back, not extending our own life. Don't be shy if you're not. Ah, uh, can I say decline? I mean, that's kind of weird because it already happened. I'm sorry, but having a contract with the cat <laughs> is just too weird. Whatever your choice. Have a nice life with Juro. No, wait. Maybe I just need to think about it some more. Yeah, they're not gonna let me decline uh, it. Women are so indecisive. <laughs> Don't be if you're not. I'm decline sorry. again. Have a nice life. Maybe I just. I, w I wonder if I can actually Don't do it enough where it does matter. Don't win games three times is a magic number. I'm sorry. Guess not. Don't be sh if you're not. Yeah, I guess not. You can fix Juro. Unless there's I... some secret ending here, we do it like a hundred times. Someone's head is what I'm best at. Oh. Okay, I will accept your contract. I mean, I guess it could happen, then but I tried. This should go without saying, but this agreement between us. If anyone finds out, the contract will be broken. And you'll never see me again. What's your real name? Call me whatever you want. Well, I don't know then. You called me something when you saw me at school. What was it? Fluffy! Oh, um... Fluffy. Now, oh, how lame. <laughs> Not very original, are you? Lots of things are fluffy. Well, whatever. I guess that's fine. Oh, he looked at me again. Aww. Are you hungry, little guy? Hey, hey. So <laughs> he looks so soft. All right, you guys have fun with the cat. Oh, look at that. Right. Acting all high and mighty last night. He looked at me again. I bet he just likes the attention. He probably yeah, does. I mean, it's hard to blame him. Oh. oh. Megumi. Fine, let's go. I can't talk to the cat anymore. Darn it. Hold on, let me go back here. I think I missed somebody here, and I don't want to miss it. He looked at me again. Are you hungry? Look so cute. Okay, I didn't miss anything. I can't. Look at his fluff. He looks so soft. Yeah, I can't interact with them. Oh, he looked at me again. Okay, I tried at least. Come on, where is she? There we go. I feel like we haven't talked in forever. Hi, Tommy. Yeah. Good Me morning, Sami-chan. Morning. I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. 
You really are Tomi. God, you that just don't want to go with your friends. Breaks my brain. You're my friend too. Or did you forget that? Well, anyways, I noticed something the other day. It was how unusually quiet your room was. So you can understand my surprise when I saw that all your things were gone. All right. I'm sorry for not saying anything. It's okay. Just kind of feels like a waste. Not taking advantage of the apartment Shikishima got for us. Huh. Then again, they are Showa era buildings. So I guess they're not that great. So, where are you living now? Oh, um, at Juro Karabe's house. Hold up, you're living with him? Seriously? Kind of. You have Morimura's permission for that, right? Mm. Well, probably. Oh. You've changed, Megumi. You think so? You've been way more proactive since you came here. Which is a good thing and all. It's just... Well, you know, he's not... I know that, but I don't care. Since the day Juro showed up, no matter how much the world might change, I decided that I would always be by his side. Oh. Ah, uh -huh. sheesh, Megumi. But I get it. I'll help any way I can. We're friends, you know? You can talk to me about anything. Oh, right. Thank you. Come on, we're gonna be late. Let's go. Tell me, I don't deserve your friendship. Oh. I hope one day you can forgive me. Yeah, it's gonna be complicated. I'm a liar. Oh, that's. Oh, that's just crushing. It's time. I have to shoot Tommy. Oh, hearing that just hurts. Find an opportunity to shoot Kisaragi. Okay, then. Usami-chan, wait! Uh, what now? I changed my mind on the melon pan. Make it a chocolate cornet instead. Yes, definitely. I like her oh, more and more on. all the time. I like the chocolate. Okay, I'll be waiting. So Yori wanted... What's wrong? Hey, Megumi. I lost at rock, paper, scissors. So I have to get stuff for everyone from the cafeteria. Well, let me go with you. Man, I'm the one who suggested it, too. Oh, right. I gotta hurry. No, 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 wait! Yeah, cafeteria would tell me, exactly. Kisaragi. Oh, good timing. Hold this. Hey. <laughs> All right. One more time. Hey, wait. I need to buy something too. Oh, fine. What do you want? Oh, uh, Anpan. She is crafty I one. You didn't like sweets. Huh? I like sweets. Yeah, who doesn't like sweets? Well, Get yours too. Keep holding that. <laughs> to the phrase she goes. Can't talk to him. Tommy. Hmm? You trying to buy bread too, Megami? Yeah. And the way these people are like trying to grab at food is creepy. Want me to get something for you too? Oh no. I'm still looking. If you don't decide soon, there's gonna be nothing left. Okay. Out of the way, you nerds! <laughs> hey, that one's mine! Uh. Hey, that one. Oh, 
kill me. Please forgive me. Oh my god. She actually shot her in the crowd. What happened? That is vicious. Okay? Uh, Mega me. Just hang on. Don't push yourself. She shows like normal more. Look at that. She just brushed inside her hair. Like nothing's okay? happened. Well, it's not that she's showing any remorse. She's probably Do you need me to take you to the nurse so doctor? ashamed of herself that she can't look at her. Huh? The cafeteria? Why are you here? Oh, right. Rock, paper, scissors. Hmm. What else did I need to buy? Huh. Oh, it sucks. God, Megami, why are you doing this? I Man, I know why you're doing this, but still, it sucks. And I know you don't Good. like it. I mean, you're ashamed of it. It's obvious. End of class. Tell me. Hey, you. Hang on a sec. I saw you. You did something to Kisaragi in the cafeteria, didn't you? Kind of? I'm not sure what you're talking about. Mm hmm Oh, you hear the music? Oh, this is Hang good. On. I like it. Don't play dumb. And this isn't just about Kisaragi. I can't remember it exactly, but you were the one who helped me before, I think. Is that right? Please stop. If you don't leave me alone, I'll call for help. Make a break for it, stay where you are. I can't re you were the is that right? Please. If you don't leave me alone. Can I do something else here? No, I don't think I can. You were, is that right? I don't think I can do anything else here. Alright, let's... Let's get the heck out of here. I guess that answers that. It was her. To be continued. Yaku Shiji story, 50% cleared. I, is that our first 50% clear? Hey! Nenji Ogata is now on the table. Oh, Jiro, we had 55%. So yeah, we're gonna have to do Ninji Ogata next time. But first, we got time for one battle. All right, who are we bringing in here? Um, Takamiya has to be on the strike team. So you have to be on the strike team. A horde of ground worker Kaiji will appear. Uh, so. Let's go. Let's take hmm, Ready. Take you. Actually, let's go ahead and um get him back. Uh get him rested and back. Uh we'll do the same let's with go. Karabe and uh Minami. That way we have these two fully rested. Uh we'll do the same with her. And uh we'll go with him as well. Upgrade the meta system. Upgrade the chip multiplier. I'm telling you, this is making me a lot of money. I'm gonna be able to buy so much eventually with all of this. And then the game's gonna end. And it won't matter. <laughs> May 27, 6 38 p.m.
You aided 1.2 million people. You did all that, Chihiro? That's crazy. That's crazy, Chihiro chan. Exactly. What did she even do? The D forces are coming. But it's like she said. Now we can fight without worrying about collateral damage. Yikes. There's a ton of those bug guys coming this way. They're bigger than tanks, but still too small for sentinels. They'll be pretty hard for us to hit. Workers, about eight meters in size. They're general purpose drones that can handle any terrain. They can also link up with the quadruped units. They form a kind of crane arm. All right, uh, activate you just to destroy all kaiju. Now, I think I forgot to look at the special objectives again. Like, I know we have to have one here, uh, Takajimi, but I, I kind of forgot the rest. Alright, uh... Okay, is all the red enemies incoming? Because that's a lot of red. Um, let's put this right here. Um... That's the only one who has, uh, that, uh, ability. Okay. We must survive. Yeah, they're- oh my god. Oh, this is a swarm. All right. Yeah. I need to think things through. Okay. Um, I don't want multi mock crystals. I want a torpedo right there. Gonna be okay. I want it's, it's a lot of it's a lot of enemies. Um, take out that. Hold on. I think I had the wrong sentinels for this mission. Hold on. I need to let them get closer to where I'm at. Slayer, oh my god, there's a lot of droids coming. Alright, 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 we need to move quickly. Um, I need, I need something that can, uh, that can cut through that. I don't want you to fly, because that's gonna put you in danger. Um, sure, fire ahead here. Try to take some of these guys out. Hold still. Bullseye. There you go. No point overthinking it. All right, they're not too close yet. Okay. But they're definitely getting there. I need to deploy my bipeds. And we're gonna deploy them. Oh man. Shoot a shield generator. I'm gonna deploy them down here. I won't give up. Ah, oh, this is dicey. There's like a lot of enemies on the field right now. I need you to. No point overthinking it. I need you to go up there to take out that thing. So go this way. Gotta do something. You have the biggest bang that we have, and that's long range missiles. So use them. Take 
Okay, okay, okay. Don't panic, don't panic, don't panic, don't panic. Um... I could put him in the middle of that. I mean, a lot of these enemies are weakened at this point. You think? Damn it. These little punks piss me off. Okay, still not like any other punks. Alright, I need you to hit that shield annoyance. Good. Good god, it's just so many. This is crazy. That's it. Got it. Are you kidding me? How could there be more? I mean, look at this screen! Play a torpedo. That's what I need. Um... It's just so much. This is crazy. Absolutely insane. Are you kidding me? All right, I know I have a guy over here, but I need to protect him. Uh, I need you to like do something about this giant thing in your face. Still alive. Still alive, still alive, still alive. I'm completely out of range. Can't help him. I can't help. Okay. Um what now? I'll try. Get down there quickly. I think I can get him. Yes! Alright! Alright, we got the big one. Oh boy, this is this is insane. Oh my god, look at all of that. And look at all of that. Okay, let's go for all of this. Kidding me is still alive? Yeah, you think? It's like everyone's being targeted. Look at all of this. Yamaguchi to the rescue, hopefully. So many of these things, like everywhere. So any big ones left? Yes, there is. Go away. Hit. Gotcha. They ought to be used to fights by now. 
I need you to get down there. I know! You know what? He keep telling me that. I see everything that's happening. Get down there. The yeah! Still alive. What What's the biggest threat? That's There's probably the biggest one. threat. That? Need to get rid of this guy. Finally! Uh, I don't know, to be honest. Um, there's just a lot of enemies everywhere. I think we are winning, like, bit by bit. I feel like that was a bad shot. There we go. There's just so much everywhere. Gotcha. Surprisingly, the city's only taking about 8% damage. I have no idea how that's happened. Okay, okay, okay. Take care of that one. That hit. Nice. They ought to be used to fights by now. Um. Let's do this. Take care of those two. All right, all right. We're doing this. We're doing this. This has been an insane mission, though. Good lord, this has been. This is like next level craziness. I think that's all of all. That was all of them. That was chaotic as heck. Man. When like everything around you is just going crazy. I don't think we've seen her storyline yet either. Come on, Yuki Chan. Yeah, I... <sighs> Look, I'm sorry. All this shit's just getting to me. Did we? Ooh. Win? That was intense. Wow. Three thousand damage. Level 10? Uh, not Sean learned warm up run. Wow, a lot of Sentinel damage. But we got the rank S. Woo! 
And we have complete both bonus objectives. All right, my friends. Well, my name is Buzz Bird. We got two more uh, city battles here. This is your blind let's play of 13 Sails Aegis Rim. Thank you for everything, my friends. I love you all so very much. And until next time, so long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.